What's going on guys? It's the Beast Pokeballer here as always coming at you guys with the next episode of Theme Battles. And uh, yeah, so last episode we had our red themed battle, and this week guys, we have ourselves a blue themed battle. Now of course guys, this is based off of Blue the Trainer, this is not a specific team he used, these are just Pokemon that he used in Pokemon Origins, um, the games, maybe if you battle your rival in Fire Red Leaf Green, or Red Blue Yellow. Uh, and also the manga. So it's just based off that. It's just a combination of Pokemon that we've seen him use before. And uh, yeah, so today we got ourselves a Rhydon, a Gyarados, Mega, we decided to go with Blastoise this week. We decided to go with Blastoise, so that's pretty cool. Alakazam, which is shiny. And who doesn't love shiny Alakazam? I know I do. Uh, next we have Arcanine, another cool Pokemon. And lastly, Pidgeot. All these Pokemon Blue has been seen using before. So yeah, this will be really cool. I'm really excited to get into the battles. Hopefully, last episode, uh, if you didn't see it, spoiler alert, but last episode, unfortunately, we ended up going 0-2 that episode. So our record is negative right now, but hopefully we can turn that around. Hopefully we can. Uh, I just want to say real quick, before we get into the battles, guys, please go ahead and leave your suggestions for next week's theme in the comments below, guys. I do get the suggestion, or I do get the team's themes from the uh, comments. So if you do that, that'd be awesome. I'd really appreciate that. And, uh, yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and, uh, start our blue battle. Here we go. Alright, guys, we're looking for the first team now. I'm gonna go with music number nine. As you can see right now, our record is three and four. We have four losses. That sucks. Uh, but hey, hopefully we'll be able to bring that around this time. I'm excited to see what we can do with this team. This team has some powerful Pokemon. So we got this dude from Japan. Aichi Japan? I probably didn't say that right at all. But hey, he's got an Ursa Ring. That's cool. Uh, of course, he's gonna bring the, the standard... Uh, you know, Mega. <laughs> Every team on Battles by Sword has some Mega Salamence. It has freaking uh, the Sword Dude, whatever, Aegislash, and Greninja. I swear, every single one. But, we need something to take on the Aegislash, so that's definitely going to be Arcanine. Do we lead with Arcanine? I'm going to say no. Let's say if we lead with like a f something with a fighting move. Do we even have that? No. Uh, why don't we lead with... Alakazam could maybe do some work. What does this Gyarados have? Alright, let's go with, let's see what Gyarados. See what Gyarados can do. We'll bring Arcanine in the back, and then lastly, why don't we bring Pidgeot? Pidgeot! Now, see what Pidgeot can do. That's a pretty cool Pokemon. Let's go. We're gonna be our Mega this time, but hopefully we can swoop up two 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 wins this episode. I would enjoy that. Even if we go two and one this episode, that still puts us an even record, and that's obviously better than being down low and I uh, just want to remind you guys that this isn't competitive battling this is just rated battle spot um, these teams are based off and made for fun not made for me to win they're just made for the themes obviously uh, please don't take my battle skills uh, for what it is from this series take it from my my Wi-Fi battle series the NPA something not this though <laughs> anyways we got this man we got our mans he's about to lead out with his Greninja no it's Rapido. okay uh, Gyarados isn't a bad lead here. He's probably going to protect turn 1. And we get the Intimidate off. That's actually awesome. Now, I don't think he gets Thunderfang. But if he does, then we'll probably die. Uh, but I'm going to Dragon Dance. He's going to, what, protect? What's he going to Baton Pass into? The Baton Pass won't do much to our Dragon Dances, dude. Sorry. So maybe if we get a really good setup Gyarados, we can actually sweep with it. Who knows? Also, Gyarados can also help take care of Age Slash, just because of the Earthquake. And like with Ice, Ice Fang, Earthquake, and Waterfall, we should be pretty set if we can get a good setup with this thing. He's going to withdraw, so that's a free Dragon Dance for us. Awesome. Going to Salamence. Yeah, so he's going to Intimidate us, which blows. Uh, but we got the Speed Up at least, so that's nice. But yeah, that was smart of him to switch into that. Uh, but now we're going to outspeed, and I know an Ice Fang will actually do a ton of damage. I don't think he's going to be able to take us out. No, I really don't. So I don't think he's going to want to take his Ice Fang at all. If it, it could miss, it could flinch, it could freeze. Many cool things could happen. Actually, missing wouldn't really be cool at all. No, that I, I would probably cry. I, oh, dude, that would be awful. Um, I don't know if I have the thumbnail template yet, guys. It might still be being made. Uh, but if it is, sorry about that. We'll see. And the series logo. Those are both being worked on at the moment. Salamence is reacting to his Mega Bracelet. I really don't think it's going to want to take this too too much, really. I don't think it's going to like it. Ice Fang going off. 
Is that going to be enough to take it out? It's not. Uh, we're going to take some life orb damage. He's going to Dragon Dance himself. That's actually pretty scary. Um, But hey, he's at really low HP. He's at really low HP. And uh, I think he's going to outspeed, but also I don't... I mean, we are Gyarados, which is a pretty tanky Pokemon. Outrage. Is he going to be able to take us out? Yeah. Dang, that sucks. Uh, well, Gyarados, unfortunately, wasn't able to take the kill there. But does Arcanine have extreme speed? Yeah, sweet. Alright, so we'll go into Arcanine now. That'll be enough to take him out. And our Intimidate goes off. Hell yeah. And uh, yeah, extreme speed should be able to finish him off here. We have also the Morning Sun. Uh, so that'll be good for helping us heal. Sharpedo scares me, yeah. What was our last Pokemon again? Hmm, Sharpedo. How are we going to work around the Sharpedo? Pidgeot. Uh. What I kind of want to do is just Flare Blitz. I don't. I think he's going to like Swords Dance or something. Hydro Pump. Miss! Okay, so he's special attacking, we know that. Ugh, this is scary. We're choice banded, and who knows what his last Pokemon is. That's also scary. Screw it, Brave Bird Boys. Oh no, is that gonna take us out? Pidgeot, eat it! Oh, yes! Oh god, the recoil. Oh god, the recoil. Focus, Ash! No, that's game! Uh oh, that was game either. Never mind. Well, we tried. So, that was the first battle, guys. Sorry it didn't go too well. Sorry it didn't go too well. <laughs> you guys are about to leave, like, savage comments like, Yo, next time, how about you make the FEMA, I don't know, good Pokemon? Oh, uh, <laughs> Um, but sorry about that guys, I'll go ahead and see you in the next battle. Alright guys, I'm just gonna go with music 7. 7 is my lucky music number, also my lucky number. So, the combination! Combinations can only be good. Anyways, we have this person, and the rating is slightly hires, higher. Um, but hey, maybe we can do some nice work, who knows. They have the Aegislaz, of course, oh my god. I kinda wanna leave with Gyarados again, I really like the Gyarados idea. Uh, in the back, how much does Alakazam do? Alakazam can do a good amount. And then last, oh, lastly, what what can't we touch here? Ugh, Rotom. Cannot really touch Rotom. Focus Ash, right? Let's Focus Ash. Yeah. Taunt, Focus Blast, Thunder Wave, and Psychic. Rotom is really annoying, and he's probably going to bring it. He might even lead off with it. I don't know, let's do that. <laughs> Hell, let's go. Maybe we'll bring on the W. Maybe we'll get some good some good setups. Who knows? Alright, my friend. What are you gonna be leading off with, buddy? What you gonna be leading off with? If we can get Gyarados get set up, we could easily sweep. The age of slash. Alright! Alright, I dig this, I dig this. Intimidate is huge. And uh, Dragon Dance, hey, why not? This is a good lead for us, actually. Stance change. You're gonna attack? Really? For real? Shadow Sneak. Oh. Uh, yeah. No, not really. Uh, I'm gonna go for a second Dragon Dance here, actually. Not to be greedy or anything, but I think he's just going to King Shield. And obviously, I don't want to take... I mean, I just want to take the opportunity if I can. Um, even though Earthquake would uh, isn't a contact move, so we won't lose our attack. But I just think that it'll be a good idea. Oh, he's going to stay in. Okay. It's not a plus two. That's actually insane. Rotom still you can't really touch it, though. He's going to Shadow Ball. Smart. Ton of damage right there. And the special deed drop, of course. 
Now though, Earthquake will hit hard. I could have killed that last turn. That sucks. If only we were Mega Gyarados and we could Earthquake that. <laughs> uh, we could Earthquake the Rotom, which is probably going to come out. Come on, Gyarados. You the MVP. Ooh. Hmm. I'm just going to Earthquake. I don't think like a Shadow Sneak or anything will kill. He might be Focus Ash. Nope. Yo! Gyarados! Yo, what's his last Pokemon? I don't think he brought Rotom. Can we get the Gyarados sweep? That'd be insane. That'd be insane. They're gonna send out the Gengar? Yo, dude, I can hit that. And we have a Focus Ash Pokemon in the back. This should be this should be game over. Unless he's out like scarfed or something. Oh he's mega. Okay. We should be able to outspeed turn one. Does he have any priority attacks? Yeah, this actually is probably going to kill, so never mind. I was only saying that we have the Focus Sash Pokemon in the back because he might have been Focus Sash, because I know people like to run Sash Gengar. But we didn't even need it. We got the Gyarados sweep. That's awesome, dude. All right, so we got our win. Uh, we need one more win to win for this episode. So I'll go ahead and see you guys in the third battle of this episode of the blue team. Uh, just another reminder, guys, leave your suggestions in the comments below. I really want some more suggestions. Uh, I'm thinking about doing polls. Uh, do you guys know iCard or iCards? They're that little eye in the top right corner of the screen that's part of YouTube. Uh, if you just tap the screen if you're on mobile or move your mouse over it, you'll see it in the top right. You can do a poll with that now. So maybe I'll do that for teams in the future. I don't know. I don't know how many characters you can put or anything. Uh, but hey, we'll see. Alright guys, so I'm going to stay with Music 7, since it's our lucky one, especially for this episode. Can we get back to 1500, or right below? Let's find out. Uh, we're 4 and 5 now, we have 8. Ugh, this person has a high rating. I can only imagine the most standard rated battle spot Pokemon. No! No Greninja, no Talonflame. Ooh, I'm liking it. That's probably Charizard Y. Alright, uh, dude. I, like, Gyarados is actually a baller. Uh, what's scary is also his that thing and uh blast was the only pokemon we haven't brought and do i see it doing work here what what can we not hit okay so we can definitely take out charizard save a lie uh what's the name of that thing scissor yeah we can get out scissor take out weavile we can take out excadrill that that dude that one dude's scary hmm let's bring blast though let's see about or i'm kind of thinking alakazam yeah Sorry, Blastoise, I guess we're not going to come this episode. Despite being basically my mascot, I'm just not feeling the Mega. I'm just feeling Gyarados is a really good Pokemon. Especially with the setup. It's really good. I need to start using it. I think it's an uh, UU now. I should probably be using it in battles more often. Maybe I'll get uh, me and Tapes to build a team for it. That'd be cool. Alright, buddy. Hit me with your best shot. What you going to bring? I'm going to predict this lead is going to be the... Excadrill, which I'll take. Excadrill, Sableye is really scary because of the burn. Sableye could be a good lead too. Might go for like Taunt or something. Wish the Alakazam had Dazzling Gleam. That'd be cool. But yeah guys, leave any themes that you want to see me do in the next episode in the comments below. So that way I can know and I can do them. That'd be awesome. Anyways, you're going to be issuing a challenge, and they're going to be leading out with Excadrill. Oh, 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 oh. Alright, so that's a scary lead. Okay, that's a scary lead. Gonna have to go into Arcanine here, I'm not going to lie. Gonna have to. You know we can eat it pretty well, right? Alright, Gyarados is going to come back, and we're going to go into Arcanine. What's he going to do? Thunderbolt or something? Alright, this thing's double intimidated. It's screwed. Let's use Glare. Okay. Arcanine's no speed demon. Not meant to be speed demon. It's supposed to be, like, bulky and attacking. So, I can just stay in, and I can actually just go for the Flare Blitz. Uh, I don't know what he'll go into to eat it. He's going to surf this mother freak. This freaker gets sir if you're kidding me. Alright, but we can eat it. Don't get paralyzed. Flare Blitz! Krakatoa. Ton of damage right there. And even if it doesn't kill, extreme speed. Yet! Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Nice. So we just need Arcanine not to get paralyzed. Come on, Arcanine. This is the only thing stopping Gyarados from sweeping, really. I think it's the only thing he had that can one one hit kill it. But I think he might have something else. I wasn't paying too much attention. We get does we all get Thunder Punch? That'd be pretty cool. I'm not sure if it does though. I've never seen anyone run it with it at least. Hmm. I don't know. Um, but anyways, we should be able to take it out here with the E-Speed. Oh, withdrawal. Smart. Smart, smart, my friend. Moldbreaker. Oh, yeah, that was a good play. We got paralyzed. That's okay. Um. The thing is, though, he can take me out, and then I can set up a Dragon Dance and outspeed the other dude. So I'll just go for Flare Blitz, because why not? He can go for his Rock Tomb all he wants. Rock Tomb, that's weird. What else do we have? Alakazam? Uh, I'm just going to keep Gyarados, and I'm going to actually straight up Waterfall. Or should I? Or could I just... I can actually just Dragon Dance. Okay, yeah. He might say it in Rock Dome. If he does, then I'm just going to Waterfall the following turn. He's, yeah, he is going to Rock Dome. That's smart. Hmm, this is a weird Pokemon set. Now we have a ton of attack, so that's good. This is actually this set actually helps. It's it's an anti setup for Gyarados completely. Anyways, I'm just gonna earthquake. Ugh, that's that's annoying actually. I hope that doesn't cost us the L. But we're able to take out his Excadrill. That's good. Oh, we're almost dead. Ew. And we're at minus one speed, too. Hmm. He can just go into his Helioptile now. Kind of destroy us. Who knows? Maybe a Thunderbolt will miss. I'm just gonna waterfall. <laughs> yep, T-Bolt. Okay. Okay, so now, next up, we have... Ourselves, Alakazam. Now, if his last Pokemon is Sableye, we have officially lost the battle. Maybe. Wait, what do we have? We ha can we have no? We cannot hit Sableye. Oh god. Um. So I guess I'm gonna Psychic. Please don't switch to that Sableye. If he goes into Sableye, I might just forfeit since we literally cannot touch it. Alright, bro. What's your last Pokemon? Ooh, this is intense, guys. I definitely want to get the W. I really want to get the W. What is it? <gasps> no! You! Well, we tried. I'm just gonna taunt. Maybe it'll struggle to death. Who knows? Ah, oh, if only I had Dazzling Gleam on this set. Yeah, but that's... I think I'm just going to forfeit. He's probably just going to try and be a jerk and stall us or something. Uh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, okay. Um, but hey, we played well. We didn't do too bad. Uh, we made the mistake with the Rock Tome. But then again, I still don't see us being able to do anything against him after that. Yeah, I don't know why he's calm minding. It's just, just kind of rude. But, uh... That's going to be the battle, guys. Um, so, yeah, that's the video. Remember to rate, comment, subscribe, leave a like, and, of course, like I said a million times, leave your suggestions in the comments below. Uh, sorry we took two L's again today. But, guys, as always, <sighs> as always, as always, as always, let the outro roll. Three, two, three,